Well, hey guys, I'm Nick and welcome back to the channel. Well, we've got some exciting Babylon 5 news to talk about today. A lot of you guys would know that the CW and JMS have been looking to reboot the uh, Babylon 5 series, which is currently in the works and uh, under deliberation by the powers that be as to whether that reboot series is going to come off. But however, we've just recently found out about another B5 project that uh, JMS has been talking about in the last couple of days on Twitter, uh, which is at a whole different project altogether. This is a, a project involving the original cast from Babylon 5. It is not a reboot series. It is something altogether different. And today we have a whole bunch of tweets to go through from JMS talking about this new exciting Babylon 5 project involving all of the original cast from the original series. Guys, if you haven't subscribed to Cypher.x yet, please don't forget to do so. Click on that big red button to stay up to date and current with all the latest sci-fi TV news on YouTube. So let's get into this super exciting news about Babylon 5 uh, and this exciting secret project that's been going on behind closed doors, separate to the uh, the reboot series that they've been talking about for a little bit of time. Okay, so just to paraphrase JMS, there are two Babylon 5 projects uh, in the works at the moment, and, and he'll clarify this in this tweet he just sent out today. Since there seems to be some confusion about all things B5, let me clarify. B5 project number one is the reboot reimagining for the CW, which is awaiting a production order. Project 2 is the one we've been doing in secret with some of the cast until there's an official announcement. All of us are sworn to secrecy and can't tell you what it is or even what medium it is in film, audio, video, game or print. So before, uh, I can only tell you that it's done and it has a 23 release date. Super exciting news here uh, from JMS about this new Babylon 5 project. It's out next year. What is it? It involves the original cast. We aren't talking about a reboot with this one. This is a, a follow-on involving the original cast to, as a new Babylon 5 project. So a few years ago, um, separate to the uh, five seasons of Babylon 5 episodes we got, there was a few uh, standalone TV movies that came out as part of the Babylon 5 franchise. In 1998, we got In the Beginning, Third Space, and River of Souls. In 99, we got A Call to Arms. In 02, we got Legend of the Rain. And in 07, we got uh, Voices in the Dark, Babylon 5 Lost Tales. Now, all these telly movies kind of involved the uh, the cast of Bab 5, and uh, and they were kind of made outside of the, um, the regular run of 22 episodes per season um, for the actual main TV series. So I'm hoping our new project falls into the same sort of category. So let's look at a few more tweets that JMS has come out with this week about this project. Uh, he says here, by the way, and for, for information, my patrons are first to hear everything related to B5 and all my other projects, getting pages from my new novel peeks into a secret B5 project that has been completed for 2023 release, commentaries, archival photos, storyboards, scripts, and more. And a lot of people thought when he first said this, that this was in relation to the uh, reboot series, but this wasn't the case. He goes on to say, the great thing is that this secret B5 project isn't one of those, maybe it'll happen, maybe it won't. It's done. It has a 23 release and is the closest thing to the original B5 in tone of anything we've done since. As if no time has passed at all, 100% crescent fresh. When people asked him, you know, is this, is this project finished? He says, done as in done, finished. And all of the main B5 cast members still around participated. I can't tell you what it is or even what form because that announcement has to come from others, but I'm very proud of it and patrons will as ever be the first to get the deets. This is huge news. He goes on to say, this is separate and apart from the B5 reimagining pilot, which is well known. This is a secret and has been flying under the radar for some time. The agonizing part is that even though it's finished, the project won't be debuted until a big presentation at next year's San Diego Comic Con, after which it will be made available. And he says it involves all of the cast. People ask, you know, does this include Claudia? He says, all means all. People ask, is this including Tracy Scoggins? And, and, and he says, what part of all means all keeps drawing up on the frying pan? So it seems like all of the original cast members that were still around have been involved in this project. So 
it, it has to be more than something like a comic book, for example, because you wouldn't need all the original cast involved if it was a comic. It has to be some form of video or audio media, whether that be a TV movie, whether that be a video game, where they've, where they've included their voices for the characters. And he says, when asked, so you're saying every surviving cast member, and he says, of the main cast, as noted, yes. The Babylon 5 reboot project was exciting to hear about, but let's face it, it's kind of like a bittersweet kind of thing because it's going to be completely recast with new characters and new actors and so forth. Whereas this involves all of the original surviving B5 cast members. So if JMS says that all means all, this means we're most likely to be getting Bruce Boxleitner as uh, John Sheridan, Claudia Christian as Ivanova, we might get to see Andrea Thompson as Talia, Billy Moomy as uh, Lanier, Caitlin Brown or Mary Kay Adams as Natoth, Peter Jurisic as Londo, Robert Russler as Warren Keffer, Jason Carter, Marcus Cole, Patricia Tolman as Lita Alexander, Tracy Scroggins as uh, Elizabeth Lockley, and maybe even Joshua Cox as, uh, as David Corwin. There's still quite a few people around, even though we've lost probably 50% of our cast, there's still a, a decent number of original B5 cast members that, you know, would be involved in this. So to think we're not only getting a reboot series potentially um, in a year or two's time from the CW, but this B5 project involving all of the original cast reprising their roles as the original characters from the show is even bigger, if you ask me. This is what fans probably want to see, a continuation to the B5 story involving the re real, you know, cast members who were there. Uh, I'm really hoping it's uh, like a telemovie kind of event, a bit like, you know, Third Space and River of Souls and so forth. They did these little one-off kind of movie projects kind of thing. That would be the most, um, you know, hopeful uh, version that it's in. If not, maybe, I don't know, maybe a video game perhaps could be cool, where they've all lended their voices to the, uh, the characters perhaps. Or even an animated series along the same sort of lines as Star Trek Prodigy or The Clone Wars. But it definitely has to be some kind of media that involves, you know, video or audio content. It can't just be a book or a novel or a comic or something like that because you wouldn't need all the original cast members back uh, for that sort of medium. It has to be audio or video based. And we get it next year in 2023, the announcement to be made at uh, the 2023 Comic Con. So can't wait for that one. Can't wait to find out what this B5 project is. And just, you know, I mean, JMS says all means all when it means uh, all the re regular cast members are returning. So super exciting news. But let me know what you think about this exciting new B5 project involving all of our original cast members. Leave a comment in the comment section and let me know your thoughts on the subject guys if you can leave a super thanks much appreciated uh, check out my merch store there's about 50 new designs in the merch store um, to check out t-shirts hoodies mugs caps you name it it's all there and always um, a sale going on so be sure to check that out help support the channel and don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already done so i'll be back very soon with my next video i'll catch you guys soon